Just Democrats, no corporate PAC money. That's why you know they can represent All right. you. That's why in so here I am. They've actually been representing you. I got my 3D printer in the mail. Actually, it wasn't in the mail. It was sitting in front of my house at 7 this morning. 7 o'clock. No, either the 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 mail guy uh, brought it really early this morning or he left it here last night which is more likely this is a $200 machine and that dipshit just left this sitting outside our house we've been in the house since yesterday afternoon you would think that at the very least they would have to knock on the door and wait for you to open the door until they leave i'm so glad this this is here anyway so yeah here we are we're uh we're opening my ender 3 ender 3 pro uh just got it in the mail this is going to uh make precision repeatable parts for me and uh it's going to open up a whole new world Hopefully I can get my uh, flashlight done, and this thing's going to help. All right, so uh, yes, I want to uh, make sure that we have all of our pieces. Can, can you guys see this? You can see this, okay. got our uh, magnetic our magnetic uh, bed extrusions cooling fan there's the, uh, the, uh, the, uh, the drive mechanism whatever it's called and I'm expecting this is probably the uh, what you call it the um, the power supply all right so let's keep opening this up and pull out more stuff to make sure that we got everything that we need <sighs> okay some instructions power cable Okay. Meanwhile, power supply. XT60 connector. Does it say how many amps and everything? Nope. This is one of the new ones that has the uh, the box made pre-made for it, so you don't have to have live wires or be touching live wires inside there so that's awesome these are two separate aluminum extrusions i guess this is for the for the z x x y for the y for the y carriage Got some filament here, some pieces that I don't know what they're for. The uh, connectors got an extra head. Oh, we got some little. Uh, what are those things called? Uh, uh, some little clips to put inside the the heads. That's awesome. That's cool that they thought about that. 
Looks like we have like a USB stick or adapter or something like that. There's our uh, limit switch for the Z axis or whatever. Here's all my tools. A couple different sizes of, uh, of hex wrenches. Uh, zip ties. I don't know. I don't know what this thing is. Oh, oh. some pliers. Okay, cool. Well, not pliers. Uh, clippers. Cl clippers, whatever. This is a carriage thing. And this right here is the uh, off center bolt. I forgot what they called that. Some screws, a belt, some more screws. They gave me a spatula. That's awesome. That's great. So I don't have to buy a spatula. I think I could probably sharpen this a little bit. Yeah, it'd be great if I cut myself open while I'm trying to get a piece off the thing. But we have this this awesome flex magnetic seal. So uh, I'm most likely not going to need the spatula because once you let it cool, you just take off your flex. Uh, magnetic thing and the uh, bed and it uh, comes right off okay two more aluminum extrusions ah, there's our little LCD with the uh, with the knob and the clicker all right awesome awesome all right I think that's about all I can pick out right now while this thing is on so let's pull this off. Looking good. There's my uh, Y, X, Y, Z, my Y coordinate thing. That's interesting. It has some kind of, has some kind of, I don't know hot glue or something strands and get all that crap off my wheels looking good this is awesome people I have a 3d printer now I'll be able to make awesome pieces hey there's the head and it has a 0.4 millimeter well I don't know it has a it has a has a, a nozzle, so I don't know, it's probably 0.4, something like that. Here's our uh, Z extruder or Y ex uh, Z motor, Y motor, something like that. Z, okay, it says Z, so I guess that's probably for the Z axis. Got uh, this piece for the for the uh, the filament roll and this piece for the filament roll and this is the uh, I think it's the Z drive whatever thing to make the carriage go up and down. So I don't know. I think I have all of my parts. That's everything. Now uh, I'm going to. 
now I'm going to put it all together uh, thank you for watching I'll show you in a couple minutes or well whatever I'll show you in the next video when I actually get everything together wish me luck wish me wish me luck let's hope and pray that uh, I got all of my pieces love you guys thanks Bye.